Have you ever recorded some video footage that's just too unstable and jerky to use in your project? Well, I have a solution for you now. Magic's Movie Edit Pro Premium has a built-in program called Mercalli 2.0, and I'm going to show you how to use that to stabilize your video. I got it, and there's gone. Welcome to Retired Time Productions. So first, I'm just going to give you the quick way to do it. First, just move a clip onto the timeline that you want to stabilize. Find the section that you want to stabilize. Sometimes it's good to pick a smaller section because it can lock up on a really long section. Just giving you a warning about that. Okay, let's say we want to do this one right here. So I'm going to clip that section. And we want to follow it along till it goes right out of sight, like, like right there. All right. Let's enlarge that. There's our clip. Now we'll just highlight it. Now go up here to the menu, scroll down, and find the ProDad Mercalli 2.0 right here, and apply the effect. Now when you apply the effect, it doesn't actually stabilize it yet. You have to run the analysis. So what I like to do, let me move this over here just a little bit. I just scroll this over. Okay. So in short, what you can do is pick the universal camera right here. The others are cool, but you don't really need them. Do the rolling shutter correction. I like to use that. And you can leave the rest default. Make sure without border is on because you don't want a border. So that's the settings I have right there. Now, just go ahead and run the analysis. And this could take quite a long time if it was a large clip, like I said, and it could freeze. Okay, so now it's done, and you can just go ahead and hit play and watch it. All right, see how that's stabilized right there? Now, there's some things the program can handle. You probably noticed the first little bit was a little still jerky, too much for it. Right there, it kind of works. So we just cut that out. There's only so much you can do with it. If it's moving all over the place, even Mercalli can't handle it. Okay, and there you go. That's stabilized now. And you can watch it and see if there's any other sections that you want to remove. It looks pretty good all the way through. I noticed a little piece at the end that wasn't good, so I'll just take that out. So it. There we go. All right, so that's how you do it. So here's another example. I have some very shaky vendor booth footage right here. And if I play it... Where's the card again? Oh, right here. Okay, TGK Connectors. That's it, right there. And you can see just how bad that is. And lots of parts. So let's just go ahead and cut that clip and trim it down here. And I'll trim it at the beginning where I started. All right, just trim it off the ends, get the part I want. And now we'll go ahead and, well, this is highlighted already. We'll go to ProDad McCallie right there. Please select a photo or video. All right, so when you click it, you're ready to go. Apply effect. Now we'll Go ahead and put the rolling shutter on, but you only need rolling shutter if you've got a CMOS camera. If you don't have a CMOS camera, if it's a CCD or something, you don't even need to check it because it won't do anything. The rest of it can be just the same as I said. These here, if you want to check it for like horizontal and vertical tilting, you can do that. So the horizontal is kind of like yaw and the vertical is kind of like pitch. And then you have roll, which is on all the time by default and then without border. So everything looks pretty good. And then you just run the analysis. All right, let's review it. Where's the card again? Oh, right here. Okay, TGK Connectors. That's it, right there. And lots of parts. So you can see that was a big improvement. You could even read the card because it wasn't shaking all around. So that's how the whole thing works. Now this is McCallie 2.0. They have a more sophisticated standalone one. I think it's 4.0 that has even more bells and whistles. 
but this is the one that's built into Magic's Movie Edit Pro Premium. It may be on the other versions too, but I don't know. I don't have them. I just have premium. But that's how it works. I hope that helps. And if you got any questions, just leave them under the video. I'll try to answer them. A lot of these things are just basically default. And I could explain how the other stuff works, but to me it doesn't really help in improving the video any. So that's why I didn't go over it. But you can play with them if you want, if you get the program. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll talk to you later.